Google's ambitions and artificial intelligence. Google launches Gemini. AI Gemini. is rolling out to work. And it's completely changing the way we work. You know, a lot has happened in a year. There have been new beginnings. We found new ways to find new ideas. Welcome to Google I.O. The annual Google I.O. conference is a highlight reel of innovation, showcasing the tech giant's latest breakthroughs. This year, AI took center stage with a lot of announcements that promise to transform how we interact with technology and the world around us. From generating high fidelity videos with text prompts to supercharging our ability to find information, Google unveiled a suite of AI advancements that redefine what's possible. Buckle up, because we're about to dive into the biggest leaps forward in Google AI, the biggest new AI announcement. In the 1990s, Google started as an online search engine company. Over the years, Google has grown and introduced many new features and services. The best new feature Google has ever introduced for Android users in recent years is Circle to Search. This feature makes searching on your phone even easier. Instead of typing out what you're looking for, you can simply draw a circle around something on your screen and Google will search for information about it. Now, Google has announced exciting updates to Gemini, the AI that powers the Android operating system. These updates include a variety of new features designed to enhance your experience. One of the standout features is homework help. The new Gemini update allows users to get assistance with physics and math word problems using a simple gesture called circle to search. Starting today, you can use a long press shortcut on your device to look up answers to various questions. When you use this feature, Google search will provide you with step-by-step -step instructions to solve the problem. And if you're stuck on a tricky physics calculation problem, you can simply circle the exact part you're having trouble with and Google will provide you with instructions right where you are. To use this homework help feature, you'll need to opt in. You can do this by going to the Search Labs menu and enabling help with math and word problems. This ensures that you get accurate and detailed assistance when you need it. Additionally, Google has introduced other useful updates like scam detection, which will help keep your device and personal information safe. According to Google, all these advancements are made possible by LearnLM, a new family of models fine-tuned for learning. LearnLM is designed to enhance the learning experience by being more effective and responsive. But Google isn't stopping there. The company plans to release more features for STEM homework help later in the year. These features will include the ability to identify graphs and diagrams, making it easier for students to get help with their math and science assignments. Google announced another exciting upcoming update. With this update, you will be able to call upon Gemini to interact directly with the app you're using. For example, you could drag and drop a Gemini-generated image into another app like Messages. This means you can easily share or use the content created by Gemini without having to switch between apps. Another cool feature will be the ability to dive deeper into a YouTube video without leaving the app you're currently using. This smooth integration aims to make your interactions with apps smoother and more efficient, allowing you to multitask and explore content more dynamically. Google's biggest new AI features, Ask Photo Search. With Gemini, Google is making it much easier to search and interact with your photos. Imagine you're at a parking station and need to pay. Instead of searching through your photos manually, you can simply ask Gemini to find your car. It will recognize cars that appear frequently in your photos, figure out which one is yours and tell you the license plate number. But Gemini can do much more than just simple searches. For example, you could ask it to show you how practice or lessons have progressed. Gemini understands different contexts so it can show you photos of swimming laps in a pool as well as snorkeling in the ocean. This new feature called Ask Photos will be rolled out this summer and more capabilities will be added over time. Gemini's multimodal abilities mean you can ask a wider range of questions and get more comprehensive answers. Its long context capability allows it to handle vast amounts of information like hundreds of pages of text, hours of audio, a full hour of video, or even an entire code repository, making it an even more powerful tool for finding and understanding your data. Another upcoming feature in Google search is Ask with Video. This feature allows you to take a video and ask Google a question about it directly within the search interface. For instance, you can record a video of a plant and ask Google to identify it. Google will then analyze the video and provide you with an instant answer. Project Astra. 
Google is working on an exciting new project for the future of AI assistants called Project Astra. This AI assistant can help you identify things and suggest improvements. For example, Project Astra can identify and name parts of a speaker that produce sound, name parts of code that handle encryption and decryption, and even suggest adding a cache between a server and a database to improve speed. Another impressive update is Notebook LM. This tool takes all your materials on the left side of the screen and turns them into a lively science discussion tailored just for you. What's even more exciting is that a third party can join the conversation and guide it in any direction you both want. Generative Media Tools Google has also introduced several updates to its generative media tools with new models for images, music, and video. One such model is Imogen 3, a photorealistic image generator. You can sign up today to try Imogen 3 and ImageFX, which is part of Google's suite of AI tools. In collaboration with YouTube, Google has been developing Music AI Sandbox, a set of professional music AI tools. These tools can create new instrumental sections from scratch and transfer styles between tracks, offering musicians and creators innovative ways to produce and enhance their music. VO is Google's new advanced generative video model that can create high-quality 1080p videos from text, images, and video prompts. It captures the details of your instructions in various visual and cinematic styles. For example, you can request an aerial shot of a landscape or a time-lapse, and then further edit your videos with additional prompts. You can use VO in Google's new experimental tool called VideoFX. This tool explores features like storyboarding and generating longer scenes. It's not just about placing an object or subject in space. VO also maintains consistency over time, making sure that elements stay true to the intended scene as the video progresses. Another exciting AI tool is Trillium, the sixth generation of tensor processing units. Trillium offers a 4.7 times improvement in compute performance per chip compared to the previous generation. This powerful enhancement will be available to Google Cloud customers in late 2024. Gmail update. Gmail is also getting an upgrade. If you have lots of unread emails, you can now simply tap the summarize option. Instead of reading through all the emails, Gemini will provide a helpful summary on a mobile card overlay. This card will highlight all the important information you need to know. Another cool feature in Gmail is the new Q&A option. You can type a question directly into the mobile card and get quick answers. This means you no longer have to search through Gmail, open each email, and look for specific information and attachments. Gemini offers powerful tools to automate workflows, making your tasks easier and more efficient. With Gemini, you can monitor and track projects smoothly. For instance, it can extract data from a folder and organize that information into a spreadsheet, saving you the time and effort of doing it manually. Gemini can also synthesize information it finds, providing you with up-to-date responses quickly. This means it can gather data from various sources, process it, and give you a summary or detailed report as needed. A special feature of Gemini is the Gemini-powered teammate called Chip. Chip can help you create documents and flag or address potential issues that the team should be aware of. Since it operates in a group space, everyone on your team can follow along and contribute whenever necessary. This collaborative environment ensures that all team members are on the same page and can jump in at any time to offer input or make changes. Gemini Live. Gemini now offers a new feature called Gemini Live, which lets you have in-depth conversations with Gemini using your voice. With Gemini Live, you can open your camera and let Gemini see what you see, allowing it to respond to your surroundings in real time. This feature allows for a personalized experience tailored to your specific needs. You can customize Gemini Live to become your expert on any topic you choose. It gathers information from various sources, including search engines and helpful extensions like Maps and Gmail. For example, if you're working on a thesis, you can upload all your research materials, notes, and sources. Soon, you'll even be able to upload interview recordings and videos. Gemini Live can analyze your materials, dissect your main points, and offer suggestions for improvement. It can even role play as your professor, providing feedback and guidance on your work. Google Talkback. Several years ago, Google created Talkback, an accessibility feature designed to assist people in navigating their phones using touch and spoken feedback. 
Now, Google is enhancing this feature even further with the advanced capabilities of Gemini Nano. With Gemini Nano, when someone sends you a photo, you'll receive a more detailed and clearer description of what's happening in the image. Even better, Gemini Nano works even when you don't have an internet connection, ensuring that you can still access important information even in offline situations. These upgrades to TalkBack will be available later this year, making it even easier for people with visual impairments to use their phones with confidence and independence. Finally, Google has introduced its latest addition, Polygemma, which is their first vision language open model. This means it can understand both text and images. It's ready for use right now, along with Gemma 2, which is part of the next generation of Gemma models. Gemma 2 will be available in June. Also, there's some news about Synth ID. It's a tool that helps identify objects or people in videos or images. Now it's expanding to include two new features, text and video recognition. This means it can analyze text and videos as well as images. In the future, Google plans to make Synth ID text watermarking available as an open source tool. This will allow developers to use it in their projects and help make the internet a safer and more secure place. All these innovations signify Google's commitment to pushing the boundaries of what AI can achieve. If you have made it this far, let us know what you think in the comments section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.